nothing else to see. If you want it to hear, to release it with your mouth. What you say is what you see. Let the redeemer of the Lord say so. What do you say to cancer? Ladies and gentlemen, in an occasion like this, there is a need for us to hear from our chief host. I have the singular honor and privilege to bring a man that is most sought for these days to conduct conventions and primaries. A transparent man, a man with integrity, a husband of one wife, a loving father and grandfather. The one we have changed his name now to the roadmaster. They call him Ekweme. We call him Arthur. If I. 
Okoa, a non-sitting member of the Senate, a medical doctor par excellence, an astute administrator, a manager of man and materials, His Excellency, Senator, Dr. Arthur Ifai Okoa, the Roadmaster and Governor of Delta State, and his lovely wife, of course, Mama Delta, Dame the Evangelist Edith Okoa, as he comes up to address us. Hallelujah. It's a faithful God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That is all you have to say, and victory will come in Jesus' name. Please, can we sit down? Will you? Today has been a very wonderful day. A very, very wonderful day. Your Excellencies, uh, for my governors, for my deputy governors, the Chief Judge of Delta State, I'm, in, I'm ignoring the people out here with me because they're part of me. Our very great leaders who are there, our royal fathers, our religious leaders, on behalf of my wife, on behalf of His Excellency, the Deputy Governor and his wife, on behalf of our members of the National Assembly, on behalf of the Chairman of the Party, PDP, on behalf of members of the House of Assembly and members of the Executive Council, on behalf of the Judiciary too, I want to thank all of you who have come in great numbers to worship the Lord our God. It cannot be better than it is. We have recognized the Lord our God as our God. We are proud of it and every year we will continue to celebrate our Democracy Day with thanksgiving and praise. And it is my hope that after 2023, that we will continue on this journey of praising God and giving thanks to God for His great mercies. I believe that we have enjoyed the praise and worship section today. If you have, say yay! Yeah. Yeah. Say praise the Lord! Yeah. We have had very wonderful times here. And I thank our fathers in the Lord, particularly Reverend Dr. Felix Omobude and Reverend Dr. Umar Bai, who have already left because they are traveling back to their various destinations. But we thank them for imparting on our lives this afternoon. I must truly thank your Excellency.